everyone. Welcome back to Lodi Marriage. We are continuing on the journey of Halo. Of Halo. Was that was that hand wave the uh, signal for me to bring the game up? Yep. Yeah, it was I, my Vanna White moment. I I, like, I, I I missed that cue. Although not really Vanna White because she she goes and touches the screen to turn the letters. More like uh, Tiffany Coyne from Let's Make a Deal. Who would know who that is besides you? People who watch Let's Make a Deal. How many of you out there watch Let's Make a Deal on a regular basis? Dude, Wayne Brady for real. Uh, don't worry, I'm not saying it's not a good show. I'm just saying that most people aren't watching it because, well, there one, it's, it's the middle of the day, and... Yeah. Oh, that was a sticky grenade. So. Stay-at-home mom life is exciting. Ain't that the truth? You get puked on, and you get to see the magic that is daytime television. It's not very good. But let's make a deal. And, you know, I have to say, because, okay, no, everybody watching has seen The Price is Right. That's just... No, oh, they have to. Inevitable. And, and any of the people who haven't seen The Price is Right have never stayed homesick from school or... Correct. Work. So, now, the youngins out there probably don't remember Bob Barker, who was the original host of The Price is Right. Yeah, no. That's why it's in the Bob Barker Studios. What? Uh, how long has it been since? Ten years. Has it been that it's long? It's been ten. Years. And Drew Carey's been doing it this entire time. Drew Carey's been doing it for ten years. So wow. when he first started doing it, he was a little awkward. But you're like, all right, like cut the guy some slack. Like he's figuring out the game. He's got some big and... shoes to fill. You exactly. Know? Yeah. I mean, who wouldn't be a little nervous about filling Bob Barker's shoes? I'm out of ammo for my pistol. Oh, dad. Oh, I'm not gonna die. I just need to find my pistol ammo. So, t we're 10 years in now. And he is still so awkward. It's almost painful to watch. Like, What's... he tries to make jokes, and I'm just like, oh, Drew. Why? Okay, well, so the thing is, Drew Carey was a comedian originally, a stand up comic. Yeah. So, and, and his style of humor does not match up to the, uh, uh, family-friendly, um... See, I've never seen any of his stand-up. It, it, it's kind of like Bob Saget. Well, not, oh. not, maybe not quite as bad as Bob Saget. I mean, Bob Saget is just... Yeah. His isn't even funny, to be honest. No. His is just crude. Yeah. You know? Um... Yeah, so Drew Carey definitely had a more, like, adult-themed... I didn't know that, yeah, actually. Yeah. But I just, like, I lost my earpiece. Well, now, how are you going to hear when I'm shooting at, 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 little, at little guys I in purple shifts? I, I just can't help but think, like, okay, so he... Uh -oh, he was also, and I think he's still on rare occasion, makes an appearance on Whose Line Is It Anyways, which is improv. Mm-hmm. Wait, who, who are we talking about now? Drew Carey. Drew Carey. Okay, back to Drew Carey. Okay. Yeah. So, what I can't understand is, like, if you're an improv actor, why are you so awkward on the fly? Well, okay, so we also have to consider this, that so we, we've seen, you know, anybody, that most people have seen Whose Line Is It Anyway. If you haven't, again, great show. Very. You know, very, very funny show. Oh, wait, this guy's got a needler. Where'd that come from? I want that gun. I want that. Ah, you have it. Ha! Gimme, 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 gimme. Um. That's quite the gun. Yeah. But anyway, so in that show, obviously, they are, you know, kind of making fun of each other, making fun of the scenario, things like that. Drew Carey can't do that. Could you imagine if he tore into some little old lady that's trying to spin that wheel? Like, really, Ethel? Really? That's the spin? Let me guess. You want to say hi to your grandkids? You know what? I hate your grandchildren. Nobody cares about your grandchildren. But the, the terrible part about it is that he has the same jokes for certain games. Like, certain games, he always makes the same joke. So you would think that after a certain point, it would start to just, like, flow naturally. Like, it wouldn't sound so awkward. But it's like each time he says it is the first time he's ever said it, and it's so painfully awkward. Well, it, it, it could be one of those, like, he, oh, I stuck that one. 
it, it, it could be one of those, like, maybe he has, like, a list of pre-approved jokes that he's allowed to say, and he hates that he has to say them. So he's just kind of like, ugh, whatever, and he phones it in, you know? I guess. Stop running away. It's... I just miss Bob. Well, the guy's like a hundred. I mean, he was in his 90s when he retired. He's in his 80s. Or his 80s. He's in his 90s now. He's still alive, right? As far as I know, I don't think Bob Barker died. I, I don't think he did either, but I, I don't really know. No. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Pause the game. We got to look this up. Yeah, I got to Google. We'll, we'll, we'll be right back. No, he's still alive. Okay, good. So Bob Barker's still alive. That's what matters. It's good thing we took that break, because I know that we... I, I honestly probably would have been thinking about it the entire time Seriously. we were playing and talking. I'd be like, is he dead? Because, like, 2016-2017 took a lot of people. It really did. Like, a lot of good people died. Yeah, it, it was it was pretty rough. That's why I was like, wait a second, did he die? Did he just get lumped into, like, the, all the people who died? Wait, wait, wait a minute. What? 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 Look at this guy. Hold on. That guy? I thought I thought it was another Spartan. Like it looked like he had a face shield. I'm like, wait, when did they put those in? Oh. So yeah, so this is the warthog. Yeah, we know how to use it. So. Yeah, so this is another thing we were talking about on Sunday um, with the with the middle schoolers is uh, if you could be in any video game, what would you be in? And I so I picked this one just for the warthog because these these things are indestructible. You can do whatever you want. You can flip them over. They don't run out of gas or ammunition. Yes, but I mean, then you're stuck in a world where you're fighting off aliens. But eventually, eventually they win. Like, like you know, spoiler, um, <laughs> humans aren't wiped out. This cave they, is not a natural know. formation. I mean, I don't know what the enemies still so are a, a, anymore. Because so um, like I said, I've played through the I've first the three Halos. I don't remember wrong. playing the fourth it's Halo, wrong. and the fifth Halo channels. just came out. I mean, it was like last year or something, but I have not played the fifth Halo. Master Chief, I'm going to use your uh, uh, I'm sorry, I have to point something out. Yeah, go. As you were entering into this area, yeah. oh, oh. Cortana See, says look, to you... Look, oh, let's flip, just walk up to it, and bang, flip it over, jump in, good to go. Wow, you got magical can't, skills, you can just I, flip a piece of equipment I, that big. I can't do that with my Mazda. Well, he's got like a special suit on, and he's a super soldier Spartan and whatnot. Right. Alright, so anyways, what Cortana say? She says something. I don't know where I'm going. I don't remember the exact wording now, but it was like, this cave is not natural. Somebody yeah, no kidding. built it. Yeah. Okay. Duh! Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so I came from the other direction. I came from over there, so I'm supposed to be going down, I think. It's like, you freaking think it's not like a regular cave. It's clearly like walls. Wait, toggle over into the old school version. Yeah, still. Yeah. Clearly, a yeah. man-made hallway. So yeah, or again, some intelligent old school, creature. new school. Just so interesting. So that that is so far is the least intelligent thing that Cortana has said. Because thank you, Captain Obvious. Wait, Halo Channel. What did you hold just on? Do? I'm supposed to be here. Give me a minute. Let me find my way back. Okay, we're back. Apparently, these things take you somewhere. Yeah, do something. Just press X to use the terminal, but I don't want him to use the terminal because I don't need to be at the Halo channel. Yeah, that was weird. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe one of these days I'll look at what it is. I gotta find out where I'm going then. So I'm not going up because I came down into the thing. It's not that way. This is like a really confusing parking garage. Right? So maybe I gotta go. The... No, because I think I'm heading back out now. I don't know what you're doing. Checkpoint and done. Okay, no, look. Here, right, here I am. Here, you here I am. Somewhere. Right. Ooh, ooh, little guy, little guy. Gotta run, him, gonna over. run him over. Oh, I'm gonna run him over. Da 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 da! Oh, oh, hey, hey, get he back here. Ya. Get back here. Are you controlling the gun? No, 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 no. That's, that's the computer. There, I got one. So that guy just like automatically shoots stuff. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. That's helpful. Problem is they have very little health, so they usually die pretty quickly. That's a shame. But all right, now if I'm not mistaken, I actually need to go do something. So, hey, eh, get out of here. 
hit you with this thing. So. Because I think it, I have to go. Oh, okay. I remember what I got to do now. Go on. What are, so what were we talking about? Living in a video game world. And you chose Halo. Yeah, just for this Jeep. I mean, that's all that I yeah. was saying. Well. I mean, a lot of kids said, like, Minecraft, things like that. Eh, whatever. I guess it could be kind of cool, but. I mean, it would be the most. I mean, from my understanding, Minecraft, you just build stuff. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Never played it. I, I actually have the digital download well, code for true. it. When I, when I bought the Xbox One, it came with that. Uh, <laughs> I got it. Yeah, I think I have to go up there. Interesting. And there, there's a button you gotta hit to extend the bridge. These stupid things in their shields. Us girls felt that that question was, was very much geared towards boys. Oh, have you never played a video game? I mean... Do, I... do you not know about video games? See, that, that's just an excuse. That's an excuse. Listen, I'm sitting with a group of 5th through 8th grade girls. And I guarantee all of them have I'm played sure video games. they have. Or at least they know of them. They could have picked anything. Anything. One did, and you want to know what she chose? What'd she choose? Qbert. Like, the old school Nintendo game? I don't know. I, as far as I know, that's... Activate. And it didn't take me to the Halo channel. Bridge. Oh. Bridge. I think... Yeah, but why Cuber? That's just a lot of I, jumping on boxes. That, yeah, I know. She was the first one to talk, so I didn't take the time to ask her why, because I had other girls to get to, but... I was kind of curious about that choice. Well, yeah. I think I probably would choose The Sims, because I'd just enter in that cheat code so that I had a ton of money and I would just create my house. Oh, you gotta cheat, though. Yeah. What am I gonna do? Go to work and earn the money and do it slowly, like in real life? Yeah, yeah, go, going to work in real life. Be a nice change of pace, you know. Just... I want to switch. I'll stay home with our daughter and you go to the steel mills. It's a great idea. You get along great with those guys. I'd get a good night's sleep. I'd be staying in a hotel room. You obviously haven't stayed in many hotel rooms. Listen, when you're as tired as I am, you pass out. A lot more crew made it off the autumn than I had predicted. The captain really gave them hell. We can find Captain Keys and the other survivors. We have a chance to coordinate an effective This is resistance. very dark on the television. Yes, it is. Well, again, you're in a cave, so... When I was outside, it wasn't bad. Uh, turn this way. But yeah, I mean, so I think having a warthog would be awesome. Oh, I agree. I'd save so much time on my morning commute. I'd just jump over other cars and... Let's be honest, you saw this thing coming up behind you and it's not slowing down. In that case, you may as well just be in GTA. No, because your vehicles can blow up in GTA. That's true, you're right. That's that's true. See? Yeah, even and, if you're and, gonna and I And I was very specific to say the first Halo. Because in Halo 2, they made it upgrade and you can actually destroy the vehicles. Uh, so their upgrade was just, you know, more realistic. Yeah, yeah. But who wants that much realism in their video games? Not me. Anything that helps me not die, oh, 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 I very oh, much oh. appreciate. Flip over. Get because back as anyone who's been watching from the beginning knows, yeah, I die a lot. Yeah, yeah. I mean, and so you the only game that she's played on this channel was Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. We never even finished it. I think we got like 2% in. Well, okay, that, that's if you're talking 100% complete. There's a lot of side quests and things like that. We were probably a quarter of the way through the storyline, I would say. I don't know if we were really that far. Have you ever played that game before? We did like two missions. Yeah, there's actually not much to the main storyline. Oh, well. It's this. Doesn't take that long. Oh, I hit a tiny branch. Alright, you know what? I'm leaving this guy behind. Um. But yeah, you know, so speaking of which, like, we always talk about going back to that game, but I, ha I just have a feeling that that, that series is kind of dead to us now. Um, originally, when we made this channel, 
Uh, the idea was I was going to teach Sandy how to play video games. And, like I said, it, it's just, you weren't getting any better. I got like, a little better. No, you really didn't. I did too. I did too. <sighs> no. I did. No. And... Ah, oh, stuck grenade I, I do feel like we we owe it to some of the early uh, viewers to do some of me playing because they all requested a base cam so that they could see that the is horror true. and pain. You know what? I, I tell you what. I tell you what. If any of our earlier viewers are out there and interested, let us know if you are interested in seeing and seeing that. Well, we can go back to that game. We can mix it in with this, this this series here, but again, I really need to hear from them because because oh, it's I that just painful. Yes, it really is. Because if people aren't going to watch it, and then I, I'm just I can't I can't do it. So, but I, I think if we should start with an easier game. Well, you know what? it's too late for that. We've already gotten that far into that game. It doesn't matter. We could just do a different one. Okay, you're picking the game. And you can't pick Bubble Bobble. Yeah, terrible game from back on the NES. It's we amazing. It. No, it's not. But on that note, we're going to end it here. I died. It's a good place to uh, just cut and run. So. True. Yeah, thanks again for joining us. And again, if you want to see Sandy play some more games. And see Gene And see my tortured. reaction. Go ahead and uh, leave a comment down below and let us know. All right? See y'all later. Bye. And no, Bubble Bobble is terrible. It's amazing. You're amazing. I know. <laughs>